dear friends, humanity is on thin ice and that ice is melting fast. As today's report of the Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change, IPCC, details, humans are responsible for virtually all global heating over the last 200 years. The climate time bomb is ticking. But today's IPCC report is a how-to guide to defuse the climate time bomb. In short, our world needs climate action on all fronts, everything, everywhere, all at once. I have proposed to the G20 a climate solidarity pact in which all big emitters make extra efforts to cut emissions and wealthier countries mobilize financial and technical resources to support emerging economies in a common effort to keep 1.5 degrees alive. It starts with parties immediately hitting the fast forward button on their net zero deadlines to get to global net zero by 2050. Specifically, leaders of developed countries must commit to reaching net zero as close as possible to 2040. This can be done. Some have already set a target as early as 2035. Leaders in emerging economies must commit to reaching net zero as close as possible to 2050 and again the limit they should all aim to respect. Every country must be part of the solution. The acceleration agenda calls for a number of other actions. Specifically, no new coal and the phasing out of coal by 2030 in OECD countries and 2040 in all other countries. Ending all international public and private funding of coal. Ensuring net zero electricity generation by 2035 for all developed countries and 2040 for the rest of the world. We must also speed up efforts to deliver climate justice to those on the front lines of many crises, none of them they caused. We can do this by safeguarding the most vulnerable communities and scaling up finance and capacities for adaptation and loss and damage, replenishing the Green Climate Fund this year and developing a roadmap to double adaptation finance before 2025, protecting everyone with early warning systems against natural disasters in four years, implementing the new loss and damage fund this year. The longer we wait on any of these crucial issues, the harder it will become. We have never been better equipped to solve the climate challenge, but we must move into warp speed climate action now. We don't have a moment to lose. Thank you.